Hello everybody, my name is 23 Monday and I'm here back with another review. This review I have the Coruscant Police Gunship. It is ages 8 to 14 and set number 75046. It contains four, 481 pieces and some and the new spring loaded spring loaded blaster type of thing. Now let's get right into the figures. To start off, we have Anakin Skywalker, Ahsoka Tano's master, and for the hair, it's just the same hair that we've been receiving. And also the face. For the, tor for the torso, he does feature the same thing. For the legs, he does have some printing, some black printing and some brown for his shoes, but does not go all the way around, which I don't think, which I don't really like it from Lego, because I think it just means that they're bad, that they have bad quality Legos. Now, next we have Ahsoka Tana. So in this case, Ahsoka Tano has been accused of killing clones and bombing the Jedi Temple. So her face, her hair piece, I think it's the same. I don't really see a difference between the 2000 when she first came out in Lego sets. But I still think it's very nice to have Ahsoka Tano again and her New detail, detailed face. Her little mad face type of thing. She also features a double sided head, which is a happy sided head. Like when she barely comes into the scene and says, You're stuck with me, stay, stay, sky guy. Then Anakin punishes her. But Torso is very detailed, very accurate to Ahsoka Tano. As you can see, she does have her strap going here and on her belt of her torso and going all the way around and some skin exposure here, 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 and here, 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 and there. On her leg, she does have the little cloth thing. And also her belt going around. Nothing much to her legs, but I don't I think they could they could have done a better job with the sides right here and on the other side. Um with my custom Ahsoka Tano, I did everything as accurate as I can. But the legs were pretty accurate, but my custom is not complete yet. So let's get on to the shock troopers. Now, the, they do come with two shock troopers, and this shock trooper is obviously red. He does feature the red thing, the red line going across there, but does not continue all the way around. He does feature the lines over his visor and some lines where his breathers are and also lines where his other breathers are. Now he does feature the same gun 
as we've been getting for the past years. Not like the stud, the stud guns that I don't know the name of. And his chest plate is filled in with red, and also his belt, and also all the way around his belt is filled in with red. He does feature some red arms, and for the leg printing, I think it's very nice because he does feature two str two straps here and there, and the new printing that is on his knee pads and the red going under it. That's it for the minifigures and let's get right into the set now. Here's the police gunship. No, the Coruscant police gunship. It has many features which I will probably not go over inside for this review but I will show you that it does have some spring lo blue spring loaded shooters and does feature some openings in here right there inside there so you could hold a few blasters and this does open so you could put Anakin Skywalker Anakin Skywalker inside here. I'm waiting for it to focus. Okay, it has clearly focused. Now this does open the way it should, like in the previous Star Wars film, Star Wars episodes. And does feature some transparent red pieces. And has the little engine compartments, or whatever you want to call it. The two blasters like on the regular gunship when they're in battle. The good thing about this is that you could put a shock trooper inside inside here. And then close it, and then you can still see the shock trooper. There are hatches all there are on both sides and I think this is the license plate and here is one of the stickers with the Republic single signal here here and on the same on the same side here and there and this is some kind of lettering which I don't really know And it does have these flaps that do some stuff, which I don't know what it is. And you can actually fit two shock troopers. Which I don't really know. Oh, I guess you put it up here. up there. Then you put the other shock trooper. Inside there. It's right there. Then you close it and you can see both of the shock troopers. You do get a lot of transparent red pieces, such as right here, here, and on the top. And on the back, and this little antenna thing. 
You could fit multiple people in here just like a regular gunship. And the spring loaded shooters do fire. Which I'm gonna try to get them to fire. Anyway, they could they can't fire. And I think that's all the details that I shown you. Yeah, I think so. So now let's look at the box. The box is pretty big. It does have the features that I have showed you with that part right there and that part with that and the spring loaded shooter and the cockpit opening and Ahsoka jumping to the police gunship and it does have the Darth Vader that we've been getting and the new Star Wars and what I've shown you on in the first part of it ages 8 to 14 which I don't really think it's necessary because People from all ages, if they're under three, they, no, if they're over three, then they could build it. And it does have all the different languages. The spring loaded shooter right there. But in different languages. If you know those languages, then you're good. It also comes with some new shock troopers same star wars thing and the set number and the different languages and the same thing and the other same thing same thing and the club the lego club and for the manual it does have same thing that's on the box. It is a 74 page build. I think it is necessary because I don't think we should have got two manuals, but instead we got one. And it has the kid with looking on the computer on Lego Lego.com slash Star Wars. Does have the Every set except the exclusive ones. As you can see, it doesn't have the tri-droid. Or the police gunship. But this is a checklist. So you could, if you buy this set, then you could check it off. If you buy that set, you could check it off. Now I have this one. And that's it. The police gunship is one of my brothers or sisters set and they were kind enough to let me review it and yeah I think that is all for the, the police gunship hope you've enjoyed and bye